Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Classic 3 XL. We got round six, game three. We got Nolan as the BJ team and Jason, the home team, on his home stadium of Peaches Garden Ooh. as the DK team. I'm Colin to my left. Papa Den. Gonna have a good game. How you doing? I'm doing pretty well. I know right now you're going through finals. I've been there before. You know, this is the first, I believe the first December in years I have not had to do finals because I've been it was in school for a very long time up until this oh great wow first catch great first catch and we're Whoa. juggling <laughs> we're <laughs> juggling and uh you know Madge doing what Madge be doing making great plays and this center field is short but it's gonna keep this ball in play we have two quick outs two pitches a star chance already won and uh, yeah now I uh I, I'm not really sure this is uh this is round six yes um I mean, obviously, without spoiling anything, you know, I know the other game was filmed before, but, you know, we've seen two stadiums really not work well with Nolan's team tonight, um, you know, which is, you know, you always want to see ding-a-dongs, but, uh, you know, this stadium, while it's big, still very possible to hit home runs out of, so, yeah. you know, but I do think, though, it's going to give Jason even that much more of an incentive, as we already see him pitch to two Bowsers, to pitch to Bowsers, you know, because the worst thing that can happen is a double, and if you know, they skill check you and they hit a perfect dinger. Well, you know, hats off to that person. And yeah. we're going to get a, ooh, we're going to get fielder swap. We should have the out. You know, one of the things I like about this stadium, I feel like it's, it's the most open. It, it buffs a lot of players, I feel like, because, it, you know, with Nolan's team, I, I'm thinking of his three toes that he's got. You know, he likes to charge swing when he, once he sees that chem. Mm -hmm. And, you know, with these blocks, even if you jam, you have the possibility to hit a no block and and get some hits that maybe you shouldn't have, right you know and that helps out with the teams that are 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 don't have the best charge swingers and have a lot of money ball characters so yeah. i feel like that works well for both teams you know i i can only assume that's why jason chose this stadium yeah. and monty's so big man yeah no this this stadium is really good for i think one star swingers and like the captains as i uh, like mario and such because those balls can really split the gaps and we're going the short way trying to get the out of third i don't think we had it at first something that I, that is interesting you know he has double bowser but he doesn't have bowser in the infield he has bowser at shortstop and bowser at first i honestly if i were no one i would have double bowser you know just have that double laser infield at all costs and we have better arms all around throwing but you know bones I believe uh, does have sliding catch, yeah. um, so that will help him in the infield too. But I mean, double laser is terrifying. I I, I definitely agree with that. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna ground her right into Bowser there. Um, but like, yeah, I, I definitely agree. I think that has the most merit because then you you have that cut off on both sides. Whereas mm -hmm. just having it on the one could lead to some right field shenanigans with some. Uh, if, if if Jason sends his runners, he mm -hmm. may not be able to get his the ball home in time mm -hmm. but we'll see you know one of, one of my favorite first base is monty monty's fun to watch you know he's just he's just a goofball i yeah, love him yeah and we have two monty's on this team so you know we're not going to be seeing if you want to see monty mole well then watch jason games because yes. monty is on anyone else's team That's all you get but jason's so if you wanted to see ball dash from four teams well ain't gonna happen yep. because monty's on one team yep. so you're you know, guaranteed 12 and from yeah. there, depending on how well he does in the playoffs, mm -hmm. he may be able to see more. Yeah, more games potentially. Bottom of the second, one nothing. Jason leading. We only have one star uh, for Jason's team, which is not terrible, honestly. Jason really doesn't have that many heavies. Um, you know, obviously no one having two. So if you can keep this game kind of close, one home run could Ooh. score and make this a, a pretty close game. Yeah, for sure. I mean, we we have seen Nolan. Be able to to hit some home runs with Bowser. It's been it's been. Oh happy. my gosh! You know it's not off the table. And Bowser is such a strong heavy that even if if you get the right contact, mm -hmm. I'm not so sure that those walls are high enough to keep it out. Yeah, or from from going out. Yeah, we have say. a we we have a pickle right now. This is a must out for Nolan. It's yeah, a must out absolutely. for Nolan. He can he get the star chance. chance. This is a huge out for Nolan. But you know what? I Ooh. trust Jason very much to win pickles. He's got it. And he's got it. Very nice. He tired Dixie out. Really great play by Nolan. He kind of just let Jason's character, you know, tire out. And this is huge. A character like Donkey Kong because Donkey Kong can score runners from pretty much first base, especially in this park. Yeah. We're charging, and this might hit a block. Oh, very close. Oh, and he let just it. Under. Oh, he missed it. Unfortunately, just missed, missed it. it. Yeah. That's really tough. You know, I couldn't tell if it was going to hit a block. I think no one felt the exact same way. But we're going to try to get this runner into scoring position. Ooh. And we would have been out. <laughs> we would have been out. Yeah. Another good, pickle good situation. Turnaround. Another pickle. Here we yeah. go. Oh, 
Yeah. Oh, okay. You know, the, the thing is, though, is you do not want this runner coming to second base because we have no stars right now. So Jason's trying the tech. He's got to not got land a homer, but he's going to push a nice single. Runners on second base and first base. A, uh, a regular slap hit could score this runner. Um, and But we, we're going for tech. And, um, yep. You know what? I'm still scared, though, because I'm scared. Waluigi... I don't know, man. Something about Waluigi with Jason. Jason just... It's his bread and butter. It's it's, it's if he makes contact with this ball, it's it's it's, it's dangerous. It's, it's like it's like peanut butter and jelly. Yes, a popcorn and chocolate milk. Uh, it's, it's well, <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that one, but peanut butter and jelly is a good one. Yeah, no, I like peanut butter. Love, and jelly. love <laughs> peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> That's like the classic combo. You know, I uh, after after you know after I go to the gym, if I don't have a protein shake on me, which is right. a lot, I go to Seven Eleven. I get a uh, Fairlife uh, forty-two gram protein shake. Mm -hmm. Vanilla or strawberry. The strawberry one to me tastes like Nesquik. Oh, the bobble! Oh, oh it's no. that Pippi! You got Pippi. Jason. Oh, wah, baby, oh, baby no. Luigi. Wah. But I, uh, I always, always get a Fairlife 42 gram protein shake. Those are great. And I was up until you know when I was bulking, I was getting one of those like uh, knockoff Smucker sandwiches from 7-Eleven, but they don't sell them anymore anywhere. Mm. I, I, I last time I bought one, uh, I've gone to so many of them. They're just not available. I don't know if they're, they're I don't know if they're if it's weird times I'm going, but I'm, I'm going at all 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 times throughout the day because I go to the gym at night, I go to the gym in the afternoon, I go to the gym in the morning, and I have not been able to find them. That's weird. Yeah, weird. I, weird. I love Smuckers. They're really so I think they're delicious. <laughs> I think I mean I think you gave me a Smuckers last time. I you did. Had them. Yeah, yeah, I love one, Smuckers. I think it was at the the 24 hour live stream. Yeah. I gave you one. Now, Colin, it's the bottom of the third. It is. It is. I okay. was just gonna remind you if you didn't have anything else to you know commentate, but I'm listening. You know what time it is. Viewers at home, except for maybe one or two of you, know what time it is. Uh, uh, Colin's uncomfy question. Now, rules are simple. I've been speed running the rules recently. Mm -hmm. um, I ask you a question. You right. can either opt into uncomfy or not comfy, or regularly <laughs> comfy, mm -hmm. I should say. And if you opt in for the uncomfy, you get a question back. As uncomfy as you want. Yeah. If you don't, you stink. Yeah. Um, well, b being but you that, don't stink. Yeah, you you know, stink. Well, well, being that I'm like the irresponsible father figure on this YouTube channel... Um, I really oh, <laughs> <laughs> boomer. Uh, boomer. <laughs> um, I, I think I think I have to opt in. I think I think it's one of those things that it's it's my uh, to do my due diligence. I think I have to opt there in. We're know. charging. We're going for tech. A really far hit ball. Wow. I thought no one was gonna overrun it. Only oh my gosh, eight hits to one. Only a one nothing wow. game. We have Bowser with a star chance leading off the bat. You're probably this gonna pitch here if you're Jason, and he's going to. Ooh, oh, is he pitching? Like okay, so yeah, I opt in. So, um. This week's, or weeks, this, today's uncomfy question. Ooh, we hit him. Is, um, when was the last time you were so angry that you did things that you looked back on and you're like, why? Why did I do that? Oh, okay. I was okay. just angry. you just like in that angry state, you know? Um, a great pitch by Jason. The last time, um, did I act out upon it? Like, like, did I or say something? So, 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 either saying the wrong thing, being yeah, like, okay, it being so angry that it led to you doing something that was like either instant regret or once you calm um, down, you're like, I don't know why. I, I got into a really bad argument with my mother. Um, it had to be maybe, maybe over a month and a half ago. Um, okay. You know, it was one of those things where, you know, I, I, I ended up saying, I, I've told the viewers before, uh, I was working at a hospital and I no, no longer am. Mm -hmm. um, I was pretty much just like an aide, uh, and that's not my deal right, at all. That's not what you want to do. Um, and I told my mother, and, you know, in order for me to pretty much get a new job, I need to obtain my license, which you're given a two year period to get, you know, get, yes. get a PTA job before that. Um, but, you know, I had got the job out of school because I had worked there as a, like, a, like a clinical, you know, intern kid. Um, so I was very lucky. Um, so when I quit my job, I said, oh, I'm going to study for my, my, my license exam. My mother uh, did not like the fact I quit, was like, oh, I'll stick it out, this and that. And like I was trying to break it down to her, like, well, I want to get a different job, and I can't get one because I don't have my license. And I'm working 40-plus hours a week, and I can't study for my test. Um, so, like, yeah, like, I, I don't want to be here. I'm depressed, this and that, for the other job. Right. And she pretty much went on to tell me that uh, you're acting like your father. Um... And great hit, by the way. Yeah. Pretty yeah, much, pretty much went now. to tell me that like I'm acting like my father. Uh, and for those who don't know, my father uh, was not a very good father to me, uh, and I didn't really grow up with him at all. So to be compared to someone who I don't have respect for, uh, and to be told that I'm acting like them when you know my father didn't go to college, my father didn't have a degree, 
Uh, to be kind of compared to that, I said to her, I was like, you know, please, oh, safe. Oh, safe. That Donkey Kong was safe. Great hit. Two nothing. <laughs> um, and to kind of be compared to that, uh, you know, I said, please don't compare me to my father. Like, mm -hmm. I'm not my father. I'm, you know, Papa Den. You're Dennis. Papa Den. Yeah. And I would appreciate if you don't do that. And she just kept saying it. She's like, mm -hmm. well, this is the same tendencies, blah, 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 blah. I just see, like, your father couldn't hold a job, blah, 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 blah. Never got fired from anything in my life. Never have not gotten a job on a hire. So I literally quit my job because I didn't like it. And it went to this huge, long 30 minute conversation. I've told Tyler a little bit about it. And it pretty much was like, I was like, you know what, Ma? Like, if you don't like it, well, I don't really. Oh, oh. oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Continue. Wow. Great tech. <laughs> I was like, Ma, if you don't like it, like, I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck. And I shouldn't have said it. You know, it's yeah. my mother. I'm an only, you know, single child to mom. So I shouldn't have said it. And uh, even the next day, she didn't talk to me. I didn't talk to her. Finally, you know, we resolve things and I, she, she understands but that was probably the maddest i was because it was like why are you why are you compare absolutely because the thing is she tells me i'm the most important thing that's ever happened to her As and you're comparing should. and you're comparing me to someone who was the worst thing you've told me to be in your life yeah. so compare me to the war so you're, you're comparing me to the worst person that you've ever had in your life to tell me i'm like them like i'm like okay that's so that's, it's, yeah. it's stunk it's stunk to hear and absolutely. i acted out i do think i was fair to be upset the way I handled it, I, I don't think you should ever uh, yell at least at a woman or your mother. Right. And I did both, so I shouldn't. I think I think that, though, like, being able to look back and be like, this is what I did wrong. Yeah. You know, this is what I don't want to do again. Yeah. You and, know? It, and it was one That's of That's the important thing. And it was one of those things. The, the conversation was, like, 30 minutes long, and I knew during the conversation, like, I knew don't 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 curse, don't yell, don't get mad. And I, and I never do. I never get to that point. And I just, I couldn't, I couldn't stop the conversation. Yeah. And I can't, the thing with, with ADHD, walking away from something, it's like it's when you have different. so many things in your mind, you can't speak fast enough. It's frustrating. So that's probably the last time I uh, really was upset about something. Absolutely. Well, I'm glad that you were able to work things out. You know, like it, that's always the important thing. When we talk Great about hit. these situations, yep. you know, it's, it's so important that when, when shit hits the fan, and things are said, things are done. Like being able to look back, be like, "Hey, I screwed Amazing up," and hit. the other person being, "Hey, I screwed up." Like, yeah, having that dialogue is is very important. Yep. So I'm glad that that worked out the way it did. Mm -hmm. um, First and third here, no outs. Great inning so far by Jason. We're doing without stars too. Oh, uh, here and we he's go. He's gonna be putting in bone. Here we've got possible mm -hmm. cursed ball. Possible I mean, curse he's, ball. He's thinking maybe about Noki, but he's. I think he's, he's trying to. I think Noel's trying to say you're you're used to my pitcher. I'm gonna put a different one in, and uh, great pitch. Oh one count. I now, think. I think maybe going for Noki there might have. Been oh the we play. oh. Mostly because Noki's a better pitcher. Mm -hmm. Curse ball doesn't really matter too much on this stadium, mm -hmm. with especially when Jason doesn't have is only heavy as DK. Mm -hmm. Um, I think that. Keeping all the chemistry Great in the infield is very important as well. Absolutely, especially with, with weaker infielders, you should have... We, the, the thing about the Classic is, is I know we've said this before, the Classic brings a lot of weak fielding um, you know, to most teams. Unless you're the Kahunas. Unless you're the Kahunas, because, you know... <laughs> Uh, but going for the tech again, second and third, no outs. I mean, this is this is. I mean, put the ball in the air; it's going to score a run for the most part. Yes. Um, but you know, these weaker infielders they bring out better throwing arms because yeah. almost every weaker infield, a lot of a lot of teams, this classic, it's crazy went, Bowser didn't make that. Yeah, play. a lot of these teams, this classic said, you know what? Instead of going with like one Noki, one shy guy, one Bones, it was like. I'm going to go with three Shy Guy. I'm going to go with two or three Bones. I'm going to go with three Nokis, right? So we're seeing a lot more chemistry around the diamond, and that makes for better throwing arms. Absolutely. So, you know, we see, and, and plus with so many different characters with laser, you know, getting hits is already hard in this game with weak characters. Moving runners without star hits is already hard in this game. And having characters with really good throwing arms all around. Oh, oh gosh, and we're going to get bobbles. bobbles like that. That's a double play that's... A single. That's really tough. You mm -hmm. hate to. This was a, this is a two nothing game up until this inning, and it's really really tough. Speaking of being really tough, I'm going to ask you a tough question. I was going to say you still have yours on yeah. the back burner. And we're going for Hit tech again. Uh, what is? I don't know if this has been asked to you before. Probably before. Um, one of my favorite. I don't want to say movies, but one of my favorite concepts has always been the butterfly effect. Because mm. I think there's a lot of times in my life where I've been like, you know what, like I really wish I could do that experience all over again. But then I think back and I say, well, if I were to redo that experience have a different perspective on things, have a different experience, yeah. that would change the course of my life today. And I don't want to change anything. I love who I am. I love the friends I have. Right. You know, I wish all the time I can go back and be 12 years old and instead of being the fat kid on the couch, I was, 
you know, in the best shape of my life, you know, but then that wouldn't lead me here. So what's I one agree. thing that if you could not change, like it wouldn't alter where you are in t like today's time, space, friends, what's one experience you would redo? Because I don't think you should ever go look, go at life saying, I wish I did that. I think there's always things that say, oh, that would have been a nice experience. So mm. what's something that maybe you wish you could redo and have a, 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 a this would have changed my life. I'm happy it didn't change my life, but if I could know it wouldn't change the course of, you know, the life that I live, right. what's one thing you would either redo or, yeah, I guess redo. Yeah, I mean, definitely the first thing that comes to mind is like, it's like I like you, you've said with your your life. I'm so ecstatic with where I'm at. You know right. what I mean? Like I'm very happy with myself. You know, start like, over here. I, I try not to be like, well, I wish I did this. I wish I did that. Right. Because, like you said, you're always you're gonna get depressed about it. You're always right. there's always things. Every single person on this planet is gonna say, I wish, I wish I was able to redo that. You know? Yeah. Um, I think one of my uh like there's a lot of things in high school that like I didn't decide to do because it's like. I just was like, no, I don't want to, you right. know? But then looking back, I would have been like, well, that would have been like pretty enriching, you right. know, a pretty yeah. cool experience. Like looking back, like in high, if you told high school me that I would look back and be like, damn, I wish I did theater. Like, Ooh, yeah. uh, I would be like, yeah. the hell is wrong with you? Yeah. You know, like, or like, you know, um, I was a winter and spring sport guy. Yeah. I never did fall sports Great except hit. one year. And I wish I did fall sports, like tried out football. Because it was a walk-on. There was no tryouts for right. football. You know, like, I could have done it. I just decided not to. Like, there was no consequence for me not doing it. But, like, I don't think it, and I don't think it would have changed the course of anything Right. had I done these things. Right. So, I, I think it's one of those things where it's like, damn. Like, I, I guess. And it's funny because my track coach, too, he was also the football coach. Mm -hmm. He was like, you know, looking back, you don't think it now, but you're going to regret not doing football. You would have been, I think, a really good uh, free safety or cornerback. He wanted me to be safety. Yeah, see? Yeah. So I I definitely I he was right. Oh, wow, going right perfect, through DK's neck. Perfect input by Jason, and you know the game just saying you know what DK's weird today. You know DK's weird. Yeah. All in all, I wish I did more in high school. Yeah. You know, and yeah. I already did a lot in high school to be yeah. fair. But yeah. Like, just more. It's good to diversify yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, become well rounded. Yeah. Both our high schools. It's funny. Both our high schools. Well, you know, very different ages. Mm -hmm. uh, both our high schools were in the same division for sports. Correct. Yeah. You guys were our rivals in track. Yes. And yeah. So we actually played you guys in the playoffs. Uh, yeah. Your school is actually on your shirt right now. So yes, yeah, the, um, <laughs> it's spelt wrong though. So. It's spelt wrong. Good luck. We, yeah, we have we have fir <laughs> we have first and, we have first and second one out. Uh, but I I yeah I you know I played baseball. I played soccer in high school. Being the overweight kid, like I you know I, I still was able to play sports. I was a really really good athlete for my size. So I'm really surprised that I was never really able to kind of lose weight. But uh, I wish I played football earlier because yeah. um, I kicked my senior year. And I was only getting like D2, D3, D1, AA offers. Had I kicked off four years at my school district, I honestly, I really think I could have, you know, maybe not got a scholarship because they don't get scholarships to kickers, but I definitely would have gone like, you know, Division One. And who knows what would have happened after that? That would have been cool. Yeah, it would have been really nice. And that's a great one of my star buddies hit. is a Division One kicker. You told me that, yeah. Yeah, yeah you told me that, yeah. He's really good. He's yep. awesome. But yeah, like, what's cool about that is like, like you were saying, like, you, you know, a lot of people. In high school, like you were saying, you were a great athlete for you. Right. Right. A lot of people, and uh, this goes for people of, oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Get out. Go. Nina. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. That would have been so nice. That oh ball gosh. just was drifting. It that was. wasn't even like, that was, the, the stadium, I, 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 that's weird. That's weird. Yeah. Like that ball went. That was a really fair ball. And just drifted. Like, it's like the wind took yeah. it. Yeah, because it, it was so. It was slowed down so. M I can't yeah. believe that didn't go out. Wow. Jason is sad. Jason you know what it is? Mad, I think. I think. Sad. It doesn't. You know what it is? It doesn't come off the bat hard enough. And you know when it's in the air for that long, I guess it just it's just automatically pushes it out. It's like when we say with the the curve trajectory that that ball goes out quick. Yeah. You know. So, man, yeah, it's really tough. But we have we do have the tech again. We have first and third. One out. But what I was saying before is a lot of people, especially in high school for some reason, because you're so worried about what people are thinking. Of course. You know, like, just just do. Go yeah. out and do. Yeah. Like, it, it's so, it, you'll be better for it. You'll figure, I mean, there'll be plenty of times where you do, and you're like, I shouldn't have. Like, or like, I didn't like that. Right. I don't want to do it. And then you don't do it anymore. Yep. But eventually, and it will be like, it'll definitely sometimes be 
definitely sometimes be the thing that like you would have never expected. Yeah. That you really like to do. So just like go out, have fun, do your thing, and and don't care. Whatever, yeah. You know. I, I think I think you know I think that the my my advice I always tell you know young people because now I'm I guess I'm not considered young anymore. Um, is I always think you should always authentically be yourself. Um, mm. Because I think at the end of the day, it's like if you're not yourself, do yourself you're, just, the you're, you're doing yourself the you favor. Know? Yeah. So, and Absolutely. I think the, the the way I learned it the hard way was when you know I was younger. I said, you know what? Like girls don't like me anyway. They're not attracted to me, so I'm just gonna go hit on every person I can. So when I would go to the bars, I literally would start a conversation with everyone. And I think that's kind of you know helped me in life now. It's because like I'll meet new people and I will almost always start the conversation, say hi, say bye. It's just it's just something that I've always been like. I just love people, and I don't think I would be this way if it wasn't for the events that I went through. Which is why I always say in life, always redo things, but never change who you are. And by changing the past, you change who you are now. So I think, uh, yeah, I think uh, you know, it's a really good Mario Superstar Baseball game and a, a good it's life, a, good good life game. lesson day. Absolutely, this is great. And we're running. We're running out. Running him out. Very Chase, nice. Jason is like 21 hits right now. Miss yeah, <laughs> he is a lot of hits. Yeah. And to be fair, for the amount of hits, yeah, not. I don't. I don't think it's a very sizable amount of runs. Yeah, I mean the thing is, Jason is you know doing little techie charges with uh, with his characters. Yeah, he's having a good time. But you know what? I think we're gonna hit one out here. I, 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 I'm, it's gotta I'm, happen. I'm right? feeling a Nina Pinta Santa Maria. I would. I would absolutely love that. Tyler is the uh, is the Nina Pinta Santa Maria shirt still on the website? It is. Don't get Nina Pinta Santa. Yeah, that would you know. Yeah. <laughs> oh my! My uh, my frames face. <laughs> well, this is it. Top of the ninth. Yeah. Last chance. Scores six runs. These are the guys. These are the them. They, these, they are them. These are your. This <laughs> this is your forever team. Honestly, six runs is not. We're getting that skill much. checked. Teams. Uh oh. Are we gonna see the third? Here it is. Okay. We made contact. It was right to Waluigi, unfortunately. Are we going to see nine? No, we're not. Okay. I was going to say, we're going to see nine skill checks. We might. We might. Still, still an opportunity. Still but an opportunity. This ball is going to be caught, but Waluigi Jason's probably going to jump. Yeah. <laughs> Jason's going to jump. Couldn't get it. Jason's my friend. I know Jason very well. He's uh, he's, uh, he's a jester. He's a little because jester. Even if you jam, we could We could, oh, we could see the block. block. Is we it see the block. Deep? Oh, what? Um, this is ridiculous. All right, got a little bit of buffoonery going on. We got to make sure runners on first base. We, oh, man. We, we can, Colin, we can do this very well. We can do this. Oh, hey, we're, we're going for that little channel. ground ball star head. I see, I I see what we're doing. No, he knows what's up. Oh, no. Oh, oh the ball ball ball. Ball. the ball. Oh, Here we oh, go. go. Keep, I do not. Keep no, oh, no, no double plays. Going into Bowser. We can do this. We can do this. As long as we don't double. Okay. Press L, you'll center yourself. You'll center. Press L. Oh, oh geez. We're All right, we're down 0-2. Getting the skill check still. We're charging. And we're jamming, but... Okay, it's not going to land. It's not going to land, but we have two Bowsers up. Okay, we have two Bowsers up. We have two Bowsers up. two Bowsers up. Jason's saying, I pitch cheese. Oh, man, what a and win. And Nolan's saying, Nolan, 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 Nolan. Oh, he can't pick it up the ball. Oh, okay. We it's probably okay. could have gotten bones, but it's okay because no, we still to. need to string some hits we need, together. We need, anyway. we, need, we need to string some hits together. Double. He wants a double cam. That's have why. Our, he wants a double our, cam. We have our captain up. Next. Oh, oh my gosh. We got the low trajectory. I thought it was going to go past that baby. And you know oh, what? We man. have double cam. Double cam. A home run could tie it. We have a star, we have a star hitter, but I think, I think we got I want to dance. I want to dance. Show us. Show me. Are we getting skill checked? Oh, my goodness. Jason, the Show! Jester. Oh. Oh, unfortunately, that's going to be the game. What an effort. <laughs> what? The... That was so sad. <laughs> How did that go so not far at all? With, two, with double cap. That's crazy. <laughs> that's a question for our members. The members yes, are on screen right know. now. If you want to become a member, the link is down in the description. Please join the Discord. Buy some merch. Like and comment this video. Show your friends our YouTube channel. We're not just a bunch of people who play baseball. We play a lot of things. We have live streams. We do a whole bunch. Uh, we love you guys very, very much. My name is Papa Den. I'm Colin. And uh, Ding Dinger City, City out. out.